Uh, and right now, folks, let's go over to our uh, man, Mr. Daryl Martin. Daryl, folks, is a, an expert at trading the Nadex products. Uh, you're going to hear him quite a bit here on TFNN. And uh, we're really proud of this guy, man, because he's teaching us a huge amount of uh, statistics, okay? And that's what it's all about, <laughs> folks, when we're looking at the Nadex products. And if you haven't uh, opened up that uh, Nadex account yet, you can test drive it, folks, by coming over to our website at TFNN. You can see right on the front page, you can open up the account. They'll put $25,000 worth of funny money with you, uh, and we're going to walk you through uh, a few trades. Daryl Martin, what's going on? Hey, man, how's it going today? Uh, it's going great, man. I know you had a great day because I said to Steve a little bit earlier, you know, when you talk, <laughs> when you talk about going up, down, and all around in the market, these products are, are the best for that. Oh, I was loving it today. Yeah, we got the, you know, literally write it down for a few points, write it back up and write it down in the entire time. No stress, limited risk. Yeah. And, and when, when he's talking about no stress, limited risk, folks, what's neat about these products versus the, you know, whether it's the E-mini you're in or, or the equity you're in, um, the defined risk is incredible, but the leverage on the defined risk is absolutely incredible. So can you, can you just walk us through like an example? Yeah, um, I walked you through a few of them because I mean, it was, cool. you got to rub the entire thing today. Yes. Um, let's just look at the the S and P E minis. We'll just ride that literally down, up, and back down again. Okay. okay. So this morning the market opens up, and you know it's been heading down overnight. So you know you're probably bearish. I mean, pretty much everybody in all the trading chat rooms, Tigers Dan, you know sure. things going down, right? And um, so you look at it, but of course, you know everything's nuts right now. It can spike against you at any given moment. Right. So market opens up, and you're looking for a trade. What you do is you look for what's called a, I call it a box spread, and Nadex, they're bull spreads. Okay. okay. Don't let the name bull, you know, confuse you. If you, if you sell it, it's bearish. If you buy it, it's bullish. Right. right. And the reason I call it a box is that the ceiling, there's a ceiling in the floor, and the ceiling on this particular spread is 1345 That means I can't lose any money if I'm selling it. If I can't lose any money if it goes above 1345 and I can make, make money all the way down to 1315 Right. Okay? So I get in the trade, you're looking at 1342, 1343 to get in the trade. So if I get in at 1342, that's a three point risk. If I do five of them to make them equal the same size as an S&P E mini contract, where yes. I'm making 50 bucks or losing 50 bucks a point. Okay? Yes. Right. Then I'm going in, I'm putting in, you know, $150. And uh, that's a $67,000 trade as far as what the thing's worth. It only cost me 150 okay? That's my risk and that's my margin. So, so watch this, folks. What he's doing is, okay, so when he says there's a roof, the roof is 1345. He's getting in and he's selling it at 1342. So he only has that risk. That, that's, that's the point there. Okay, go ahead. Exactly. So now I can make money all the way down. And, you know, you're just waiting. We're all anticipating for it to drop. And um, it starts coming down. And, you know, we're up, we're up. I mean, basically, it's making money, okay? And then all of a sudden, things start to turn around. 935, 940. Yes. Okay? Yes. Um, so what you do is I, I go and I pull the trade off. I'm like, you know what? I'm up a few points. I risked a few points. I'm going to go ahead and disclose the trade out. And the perfect thing that's happening right here is I'm also at the floor of another spread. Okay, right. so I risked 150, made 150, closed the trade out. Now I'm at the floor of another spread. There's another spread. 1340 is the floor, okay? Yes. 1380 is the ceiling. Because they, right? have, they normally have three spreads in the morning, right? They have three spreads that they actually start out at 6 o'clock. They have four that start out at 6 o'clock. Okay. okay. They have the master spread and then three other ones that run from like 6 p.m. Yes. Central to 3.15 Central. Right. And then they're going to launch some other ones at 7 a.m. They're going to launch three more in addition to that. Right. And then every two hours after that, or actually every hour after that, you're getting more spreads loaded up. So you're always getting these new strikes coming out. Yes. Okay? So there's, these also expire at you know, 3.15 Central, 4.15 Eastern. Right. I'm going at 13.40. We're looking at that. And you can go and you can buy it literally now to go long at only you know, a few points risk. So let's say we're risking the same 150, okay? Yes. So I had 150 bucks at risk. I made 150. Now I'm putting on a trade risk free, okay? Yes. Now I'm going long the market because I already made 150. So I'm playing with the house's money at this point, okay? Yes. So I go long. I'm able to ride it up. And um, basically, right around the lunchtime, little everything starts calming down, and then you know we get a little spike, and it looks like you know we're getting ready for a reversal. Right around, I guess it'd be uh, one o'clock, two o'clock your time. Right. And so I'm starting to think, you know, we're getting we're getting to a point where we might reverse, we might not reverse. Go ahead and close out the trade. Okay, get out of thirteen fifty seven. So we get in at thirteen forty two, okay, or thirteen forty three, and get out of thirteen fifty seven. So you're looking at you know basically a fourteen, you know. 
point profit on that trade. Right. And you know, with that being 50 bucks a point, you're going to have $700 profit on a $150 risk at this point. All right? You're not done, though. <laughs> There's another spread that has a, a literally a ceiling at 1360 Okay? Right. And you can go in, and you know we got out of 1357 so now we're going to sell that one for 1357 We only have, again, a three-point risk. And you're able to ride that down literally through the end of the day, and it closes out, you know, right around 13, I want to say 46 is our settlement price. Yes. Around there. Yes. And um, so 1346, 1347. So you're literally able to pull out a few more points out of the market. And, uh, you know, for a total of six extra points, you know, that comes in um, once, you know, all the math is done and everything and you're know, adding commissions and stuff like that. And, and folks, so, the thing that is so cool, you know, uh, that, uh, uh, and, and, you know, we're going to walk you through this, but go over and open up. Yeah, you can open a demo account so you can understand what Daryl's talking about with these floors and ceilings. Because when you first look at them, it's going to be a little confusing. I can tell you, you know, I, I've, I've traded every product in the world. And you just have to get to understand them. I and I said to Steve, I, after the first time I had you on, Daryl, right? Oh, man, yeah. you had my light bulbs going off. Because in the morning, I said to Steve, I get it now. I get it, man. You want to trade these things as close to the ceiling and the floor as you can. That's right, yeah. You know, and so it's so cool, man, because... You know, the, the, that defined risk is amazing as to how much the risk is versus the profit is, you know? So oh, yeah. It's, it is amazing, man. It's, Your this, leverage is insane. I mean, you're talking like 400, 300 to 1 it, leverage. It, exactly, without getting but, wiped out. That's, yeah, with like a hundred fifty dollar risk. Yeah, that, that's a whole, it's a whole different ball game, folks. And I can tell you something that Daryl and I were talking about this at the beginning of all these product cycles. And I'll tell you, this was in the OEX, this was in the direction shares, the pro shares. The beginning is where the whole advantage takes place, you know. And that's going to be the next year, year and a half. Um, and, and the reason, folks, that it's like that, because the more of the folks understand it, of course, they're going to get the volumes and they're going to get everything in it because it's a great product. Um, and, you know, the uh, Daryl's going to be on, we have a, a Nadex binary hour uh, Friday. So uh, you stay tuned because uh, he's going to be coming on uh, at 20 past 10. Oh, we're cool. we're going to be uh, cool. talking with him on Friday. Uh, and you want to wrap your head around these, particularly, uh, you know, because uh, whether you, if, you trade, if you trade the E-minis, this is a no-brainer. I mean, it, it's it, if you're trading the spies, you, you, you're trading the same trades, uh, you're just trading with less money. And uh, less risk. Exactly. So soon we're going to have more education coming out your way too. So we'll have all that. A lot more education. Oh, it's a, it's a, <laughs> it's, a, it's a beautiful thing, man. That's right. Listen, folks, uh, we we are going to get this uh, cooking. Uh, Daryl is going to be uh, not only on the program; he's going to be having his own show. We're putting that all together right now. He's going to be out here growling and prowling with you, big time, man. A, you know it. Listen, man, it's a beautiful thing. We really appreciate all your help. And, of course, uh, you know, look forward to having you on Friday. Talk to you then. Have okay, a great day. Okay, man. Have a great one. Have a safe one. Tom O'Brien, Steve Rhodes, Daryl Martin, we appreciate you growling and prowling out here with us, folks. We had the Dow finish down 97. NASDAQ off 11. S&P's off 9. We're going to be right back.